<laughs> I don't even know what to say about this game. It was so weird. I guess I'll just show you some of the things from the very end because they're pretty interesting. Now, I went ahead and covered up parts of the screen because I don't want you to know if we won or lost until you watch this entire video all the way through. But basically, you can sum this game up as a lag central. These floating hammers belong to the Vindicators. They're just hanging out, chilling in the air because the game was so laggy. Also, check out these explosions that I don't think you're going to see at the end because I probably cut them off. These were happening way, way after the Void Reaver was gone. At first, I was like, what is happening here? This game is already over. What are they shooting at? And then I realized that these were just explosions from the Pursuit's rockets that were lagging so far behind that they were still exploding minutes after the game ended. So just in case you're not picking up what I'm throwing down, this game gets very laggy. I sped up the footage times two, which means that whenever my game freezes from lag, it was actually frozen for twice as long as you're seeing here. I just want y'all to know that when this happens, it wasn't my computer, it isn't your computer, it's just the game. Now, in my humble Bruh. child opinion, this makes it not as much fun to watch the ending because of the constant freezing, but I did get a lot of good footage of the massive amount of pursuits circling around in the beginning of the game, which is what I really like to see with this tower. One of the coolest things about the pursuit is that we didn't have to use the pyro to kill the leads or the rangers to kill the lead balloons because the helicopter can handle both with ease, but we do put down a couple of rangers at the end because one of these enemies is so fast that it actually evades most of the pursuit's bullets and rockets and we didn't want to die to anything but the void reaver so we use the rangers just to kill it and on that note that's really all i got to say so go ahead and sit back and enjoy infinite pursuits versus hardcore mode
Whoa, no way! Pursuits actually won this challenge? And they only finished one minute slower than the accelerators? What is going on? I did not see that coming. I just didn't think they could do enough damage to take down the 1.2 million health Void Reaver. I mean, look at these stats. Only 80 DPS at max level. I guess there were just so many of them that they overwhelmed the Void Reaver, or maybe it just died by lag. I don't know. Alright, now if you enjoyed this insane content, go ahead and smash that like button with your forehead, hit the subscribe button with your big toe, and turn on notifications however you can so you don't miss any of my amazing upcoming content, and I will see you guys next time for turrets. In the meantime, take care, be safe, and never forget what I always say, peace!